Here are the stories making news at this hour. I'm Marissa Bailey. State lawmakers are grilling Chicago public schools officials in the wake of a sex abuse scandal. A recent investigation found the district failed to protect hundreds of school kids from predators. And I will never be the same as a result of what has been done to me. Two former students cried as they testified about incidents that happened years ago but still affect them today. Both felt CPS administrators treated them unfairly after they reported sex abuse. A Chicago Tribune investigation found hundreds of sex abuse cases that went unreported or were underreported by CPS over the years. Today, state senators and reps will also hear from State Board of Education officials, DCFS investigators, and the Chicago Teachers Union members. Senator Jackie Collins put signs on two vacant chairs to show some notable absences, that of CPS Board of Ed President Frank Clark and CPS CEO Janice Jackson. Here's more from a sex abuse victim. I'm here to shed light on the re-traumatizing, intimidating interrogations, the questions of my dignity, of my intent, of my character after I'd been assaulted by my teacher. I was shuttered into the dark. I felt like I was the one under investigation. Now, in light of this whole scandal, CPS has already released a plan of action that includes rerunning background checks for the district's 55,000 employees, coaches, volunteers, and vendors, implementing a child abuse public awareness campaign, and retraining employees on child sex abuse reporting requirements. And meteorologist Megan Glaros has a look at your forecast. Hi, everybody. It is the last day of spring, at least the last full day of spring. Tomorrow morning at 5.07 a.m. is the summer solstice. We turn to a brand new season. Now, clearly over the course of the weekend when we were up into the 90s, it felt like summer, but technically not yet. It starts tomorrow. Today will be in the 70s. Tomorrow will be in the 70s. Could see a few scattered showers both days and with a lot of cloud cover, but all things considered, it's not bad out there. You are just going to need to grab the umbrella and keep it with you for the next couple of days. Not heavy rain, just a chance of some showers.